temple on top of the Acrocorinth. That's what I'm looking for. Vietera, where are they? Vietera aren't here. Then you're going to pay for the trouble we went through to find them. We're here in peace. Aphrodite, aid us! Who do they think they are? I need to stop them. is dedicated to them, the brutes. <sighs> Thieves are here and the Etera aren't. The Etera? <laughs> They're much wiser than we are. They realize their visitors were all getting robbed on the way in. There's no avoiding the mongers' men in Corinth. I'll keep my guard up. He craves money, Mistyos. Not only that, but power. Once he smells it on you, you're a gunner. So the Mongir is a Corinthian criminal? Master of the underground markets. He rules with one hand open for money and the other clenched around a weapon. A drachmi and blood-hungry monsters what he is. If you know of the Etera, then you know of Anthusa. I'm looking for her. They say she's everywhere. Though I've never seen her. But the Etera see everything. I've seen them gather by the spring of Pireni, down the mountain. They meet clients there and then take them elsewhere in secret. Good. Maybe pray to Aphrodite from home next time.
I'm here to worship Aphrodite, but the view is the real beauty. Nice view. It just got a lot nicer. I was hoping to see you again. Alcibiades, what are you doing outside of Athens? Someone like me is always on the move. I've docked my ship in every port. I'm sure you have. If you're here for more than the view, I have a task for you. It is crucial this package gets to its proper recipient. It's not for me, but a man named Theodoros. I'll help. But it's only that little box? One should never judge something by its size, you know. A small thing may very well make a huge impact. You said this package isn't from you. Why do you have it, then? It simply came into my hands, that's all. The Theodoros asked for my help, like I'm asking for yours now. Why can't this Theodoros deliver it himself? You're a curious one, aren't you? Some questions don't have answers. Sometimes things just... are. All right. Who am I giving the package to? There's a man named Vardas near the Corinthian military fort. He's one of their stronger... assets. And I just tell him it's from you. <sighs> no, uh, from the Odoros. Don't forget, the Odoros. Artemistios I sent for. What do you want? This is for you. Give it here. Is this some kind of joke? This is a cast of someone's dick. What's this engraving? This is for your wife, Thalia, for when she starts to miss me. Tell me now, who sent this? Do you know a man named Theodoros? Theodoros? He'll pay for this with his life. I'll destroy his men. I'll destroy his ship. He'll regret ever touching Thalia.
Kill that creature! Spark and never lose it! I was just starting to miss you. I hope you delivered the, uh, package? Vardas threatened to kill the others when I told him. I also wasn't expecting the package to be... well... that. It was a nice surprise, wasn't it? I can make another one for you too, if you'd like. Another one? You... It was mine, yes. It looked good, didn't it? I needed to get the Odoros out of the way, and now he will be. I impress myself sometimes. Whatever you say. Why don't we let our bodies do the talking? Surely you had thoughts of it as well when you saw the cast of me? Here? Before the gods? Let's make an offering. I'm not interested. Oh, a shame. Aphrodite would have loved it. Maybe another time.
careful not to get spotted.
της Ιπποκράτησης Κλινίκ. Look, you insignificant peon. Tell me where he is, or by Ira, I'll burn this clinic to the ground with you in it. I already told you what I know. I don't ask much. Hippocrates must show humility to ensure public order, prostrate himself before the gods, and declare that his skills are gods given. But that won't help his patients. It'll just take him away from his work. If Hippocrates thinks he can disrupt social order to make himself into a demigod of healing, well, perhaps the gods themselves will have their revenge. I'm sure there's no need for raised voices. Who are you? I'm looking for a man named Hippocrates. Yet another crazed follower of the madman himself. Tell your impious master that unless he makes a public apology and soon, this priestess of Ira will gather an army of faithful and shut him down. Out of my way. Oh, thank all the gods she's gone. I thought she was going to kill me this time. What's going on? I am Sostratos. Crisis has accused my master Hippocrates of impiety. Is he impious? He believes that beyond praying, people can take their health into their own hands and make themselves well. Fascinating. Can I speak with him? I'm sorry, he isn't here. I'll find him. If you're going to meet Hippocrates, could I trouble you with a small errand? Depends what it is. I want you to bring him some equipment. He was in such a hurry, he left it behind. I could bring that to Hippocrates. Really? I'll be sure he gets the equipment. You have my thanks. How will I know when I've found Hippocrates? Follow the road southeast of Hera's watch, to the cave of Pan. He won't have set up far from it. Look for a long line of sick people. He's a uh, balding, but I wouldn't mention that if I were you. <laughs> So many sick people. Can one man help all of them?
So, what has caused this man's condition? An excess of phlegm, doctor. In the immediate sense, yes. But more importantly, he suffers from neglect. Neglect? Good food, warm clothing, so much could have helped. But since other caretakers assumed his condition was a punishment from the gods, they neglected him. Challenging tradition. You must be Hippocrates. Yes, I'm also very busy. This will only take a moment. I won't keep you away from your patients and your students. Observation, experience, and experimentation are crucial for treatment. My followers are learning that. I've come from your clinic in Argos. Sostratos asked me to give you this. I knew I forgot some things. Sostratos is a good physician, but a better apprentice there is none. Did you ask him to pay you for this delivery? No. I knew this would help you and your patients. That's good enough for me. Quite admirable. What did you say your name was? Cassandra of Sparta. Well met, Cassandra of Sparta. What do you need? I've been searching for a Spartan woman. What makes you think I would know her? I was told you may have helped her a long time ago. Maybe the priests at the sanctuary of Asclepios can help. They keep detailed records of all who pass through. Please, Hippocrates, I came very far to meet you. As did this patient, and the one before him, and the one before her. My patients need me, but my notes on diseases of the mind were taken. Retrieve them, and I will help you find what you seek. Hurry, this patient doesn't have much time left. I'll do my best with what you've told me. Good luck. We're depending on you. His notes are well guarded. Why? 